everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Reaction Therapy. I'm your resident psychotherapist, Tom Stevens, here to break down lyrics to some awesome music. And today is going to be awesome because today we have Lil Peep live forever. We're going to listen to today. You know our mission, spread mental health awareness to the world through music and lyrics. And I know Lil Peep's not going to disappoint us. I wish he would live forever. Wish I could have talked to him. Wish I could have heard some wisdom. Oh my goodness, I can't wait. Thanks so much. If you want more reaction therapy than you could imagine, go to our Patreon page or go to YouTube. There are memberships there with private live streams, extra content, so much more. But without further ado, it's time, Lil Peep, live forever. Hmm. I haven't seen little people like this before. I don't know. This is like home movie style. And just the rawness for him of saying, look, man, life's not always great, man. And I'll tell you when I have an issue with you or what you believe or who you are. And, you know, I've been working like I never had a job. Like I'm working so hard. Uh, but when you work like you've never had a job, mm. Where do you go? Nowhere to go but up from there. But look, this is, I am waiting for the point where everything just drops in for him because he makes me smile every time I listen to him. Just love it. too much because this build up here that's intense like it just keeps going over and over and he just doesn't stop i just wonder what's coming next it's like he's in this cycle of life where it just keeps going round and around and what's the point that's why i live the way that i do because i've already got this figured out and this is the way life's gonna be being on the big screen I do want to know the story of, is this about his relationships? Is this about the life that he lives? Is this about his career? Like, where'd this come from? And when was it in his career? what it's like to sit and talk with him if that would if that would have been possible what it would have been like me sitting across from him hearing what he's got to say based on his life who he's been around what he's been through the way people had treated him his fame all of that because this is saying the same thing over and over right the lyrics very simple straightforward just not expanding on a bunch of different things but wow 
look at the even the scenery for him of just the grayness you know it's dark it's cold it looks like and it's just him Look, you know I don't ascribe to a lot of the things I hear in songs that are toxic, that are addictive, that are unhealthy, that bring you into bad cycles, like all the using, all the, you know, forget life, just do whatever you want to do. I don't ascribe to all of that. But I do ascribe to the music, and I can see how many, many people relate to that. And I do listen to the music to try to see whether I like actually hearing it. And I love hearing that melody and the clicks and the booms and the sounds that go in that. I could sit back and just listen to that song and not even know all the words on it, even though I do, because I read them. But I can see why people relate so much to what he's talking about and how hard it is to find hope in life every day. And when I'm on the drug, I have a new dream and something new happens. And that's so often why people go and will use is to be able to escape the reality of life that seems dreamless or hopeless and go into a world where there's possibility and it seems to free people up, or at least it feels that way. But the trouble is life just comes right back in. And that's why getting help, getting good mental health treatment actually gives a stronger result than using in the end. But it's just hard to imagine going down that hard path. But remember, look, this isn't real therapy. Just Tom bringing down lyrics to music. If you want professional uh, advice, just click on the link in the description of this video. It's there. I love Lil Peep. I can listen to Lil Peep all the time. He is one of my favorites. He is on that playlist, and I listen to him. And there's not a lot. There are a lot of things he says that I'm like, man, I wish I could have talked to him. I wish I could could have helped somehow for him to see a difference in life. But the music's fire great. Thanks for being here. Look, if you want to leave your comment feedback insight, we want to read it. If you want more reaction therapy, go to our Patreon page. Go to YouTube. It's out there. And look, thank you, because we are trying to spread mental health awareness to the world through music and lyrics, and you are a part of doing that. Thanks so much for being here. We'll see you on the next Reaction Therapy. Yeah.